Say Brakate Yahawa, Brakate Yahushai, Brakate Yahawa, Brakate Yahushai, Brakate Yahawa, Brakate Yahushai. First and foremost, we want to give all praises and honor and glory to Yahawa, Bashem, Yahawashai, Bashem, Raka Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akiyams in the four kind of yard. We're pushing the gospel in sincerity to truth shallow one. Alright, this evening, come the next lesson to feed the elect of the nation of Israel, the 144,000, the one third men, women, and children, and the confusion of faith that's kept in the four kind of the earth. Alright, you know, we just, just glorify Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, you know, this, this, this lesson is about, you know, we gotta glorify Him to our best ability, you know, as He gives us life and strength. <coughs> we gotta glorify Him, right? Uh, this is, um, just like, that's like what Yahweh Shai did. You know, he glorified Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Right? This is um, John 14 and um, 12. He said, Verily, verily, I said, unto you, I said unto you, He that believeth on me, the works that I do shall he do also, and greater works than these shall he do, because I go unto my Father. Right? Showing that the Father and the Son is two separate entities. Right? He said, And whatsoever he he shall ask in my name, that will I do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. Right? So we, yeah, when Yahweh Shai was walking on the earth, he glorified Yahweh. And this is the same, this is this is the same mind that we're supposed to be in too. Right? Glorifying Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai said, whatever we ask in his name, he will do. Right? He will do. Right? So that the Father may be glorified in the Son. So it's all about glorifying Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Right? Who shall, the scripture says in our Psalm, who shall stand for me against the evil do? Who shall stand for me against the evil do? Roughly paraphrasing. So it's all about standing for Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Right? This is Psalms 86 and 9. He said, All nations whom thou hast made shall come and worship before thee, O Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, and shall glorify thy name. Right, the elect shall glorify the name of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Right, this is um, the book of um, Sirach Ecclesiastical, chapter 17, verse 10. He said, And the elect shall praise his holy name, and the elect are the nation of Israel, 144,000 men and children, shall praise his holy name. Right, um, Psalms, Psalms 113. Um, uh, verse 3 he said from the rising of the sun unto the going down of the same the Lord Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai name is to be praised yeah the name of the Lord is to be praised right he's to be he's, he's to be praised above all gods right Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai is why Starting with our pastors and elders, we push the name of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh We teach the name of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Right? This Psalm 86 and um, 12, he said, I will praise thee, O Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh my power with all my heart and will, and will, and I will glorify thy name forevermore. Glorify the name of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh forevermore. Right? And it's only the, it's only the elect gonna do that. Only the leg gonna stand stiffly and confess the name of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Right? Um, let me say quick. This is a second, second Ezra chapter 2, verse 47. Let's get straight to the point. This is when Ezra saw the vision when Yahweh Shai was crowned in the man of the Lord. Right? And he asked the angel, Who is this young man? With this with so high stature, right? And this is what the angel said to him. Second second Ezra chapter 2, verse 47. So he answered and said unto me, It is the son of the Mosai whom they have confessed in the world. Right? He said, Then began I greatly to commend them that, that stood so stiffly for the name of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Right? So it's only the men the Lord can do that. Glorify him, we're gonna stand stiffly. Right? They can they 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 can stand stiff stiffly. They can praise the name of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh forevermore. 
right? But this one is Psalms 86 and 12. It says, I will praise thee, O Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, my power, with all my heart, and I will glorify thy name forevermore, right? And the elect, starting with the elect and in the kingdom, when the two thirds come back in the kingdom, true boy, send a dig. The whole nation of Israel can praise Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, forevermore, right? Psalms 22. And 22, he said, I will declare thy name unto my brethren in the midst of the congregation. Will I, will I praise thee? Right? And this we wish out in the highway by we declare the name, we push the name Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Right? Yahweh, who the world is going to call God. Right? Yahweh means he is, he exists. And Yahweh Shai, who the world is going to call Jesus, which he is the Savior and the Deliverer. So we push the name Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. We praise Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Glorify his name in the earth. Right? Verse 23, that day, he said, He that fear the Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, praise him. Right? Only the elect gonna do that. He said, All he all he seed of Jacob glorify his name. Glorify him and fear him. All he seed of Israel. So it's only the Israelites gonna praise praise Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, not the heathens. But in the kingdom, the heathens will praise Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. God, we gonna we gonna make the do it. Right? So we gonna make the do it in the kingdom, right? is Isaiah uh, <laughs> that we can be ruling over the heathens right? the kingdom is not for the heathens only for the Israelites the heathens can be perpetual servants is Isaiah 24 and 15 he said wherefore glorify he the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahushai right he said in the fires even the name of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahushai power of Israel in the isles of the sea, right? So we glorify the name of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, right? This is um, this is Romans, right? Um, Romans fifteen and six. This is Romans chapter fifteen verse six. It's um, yeah. Romans chapter 15 verse 6, start from verse 5, he said, Now the power of power of patience and consolation grant you to be like-minded one towards another, according to Yahweh Shai Mashiach, that he may with one mind and one mouth glorify Yahweh. And this is this mean glorify Yahweh. Right? This is all about glorifying Yahweh to your best ability. Even the Father of our Lord Yahweh Shai. Right? Glorify Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai to your best ability. Right, this revelation, right, chapter 15, verse 4. Who shall fear thee, O Lord Yahweh, and glorify thy name? Only the elect. <laughs> for thou only art, he said, for thou only are holy, for all nations shall come and worship before thee. For thy judgment are made manifest. For thy judgment are made manifest. Right? This is Sirach chapter 43, which is the book of Ecclesiasticus. Verse 30, when he glorified the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai exalt him as much as he can, for, for even yet will he far exceed. And when he exalt him, put forth all your strength, and be not weary, for he can never go far enough. So put forth all your strength, and glorify Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Right? And with that, hope it lets me edifying. I want to give all praises and honor and glory to Yahweh. Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem Raka Kadash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well a great millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akyams in the folk and the earth, pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. Shalom.